Yep. Hi guys, how's it going? So yeah, uh, just uh, got a little package today from uh, from Amazon, and I figured I'd show you what it uh, what it all looks like. You know, just let me know if you guys are uh, if you guys see anything, or you know, you know if you if I, if you notice any problems or anything like that. So yeah, let's get started. So this right here is the box. This was a box in a box. This is how you when if you order this book or books. This is how it it starts out as. This is giant thing that you right here. So I'm gonna go get some scissors and I'm just going to open this up for you guys so you can see. I have not seen this, so you'll be as I'll be as surprised as you are with this one. So this thing is two. Uh, from what I read on Amazon, it is a two um, art books. One is all the Groundworks book uh, stuff, like sketches and stuff like done by Sho Yoji Shinkawa. And then the rest of it is a bunch of the uh, promotional pieces uh, or key art, as the game industry likes to use. So these are all the things that you find in magazines and stuff like that. I don't know exactly what's in here, but we'll see. So I'm just opening it up now. You can hear me doing it. All right. So yes. So I have the chat open on YouTube if you guys have any sort of questions as about this thing. All right, so this is it. Check that thing out. So this is two books inside of a case. Uh, let me see. There. You can see it from the side there. So that's the side view. That's the back right there. There is the front. So it's literally two giant books inside of one case. So I'm going to open this up so you can see what this is. The The packaging to this actually looks very similar to the one um, created for Metal Gear Solid 5. Actually, you know, before we even start, I want to show you some stuff. But let's get this first. is huge all right so what we have here is the backing of the of this 20 years of uh, tactical espionage action concept art and design and creativity that's what that back says there so yeah let's open this up okay so we look you look right here and this thing opens up from the side and inside you find both books let's see Let's look at the Studio Works first. This is the Studio Works book. So this is all probably just stuff from Yuji Shinkawa's like sketches and designs. Let's see what we got here. The studio Works. So this is pretty much the. If you if, if you ever know like these Metal Gear books have never like the, a full comprehensive Metal Gear. Uh, book has art book has never come out in the states. I I know this because I have pretty much every single one that was produced in Japan. So just to give you an idea, this is all Metal Gear Solid One stuff. Uh, more Metal Gear Solid Solid stuff. This is two. There's Pliskin stuff like that. It's got a lot of stuff inside of this. Environments. So, this is Metal Gear Solid Three. Metal Gear Solid Three officially did not have, uh, at least from what that I know of, did not have an actual art book release until the uh, Metal Gear HD Collection when they released a, a portion of the of what was in there. So this is probably the most comprehensive uh, Metal Gear Solid Three um, uh, I've ever seen as far as design work. A lot of this stuff like. <laughs> so if you guys know um this is the this is the fury i drew the fury for um uh for uh, my own little art book called solid zero and it was so difficult to find actual reference of the fury of his mat with his mask off and check that out there he is right there <laughs> i had i literally found 3d models and all kinds of stuff I had all these different things that i was working from so I wish I had that in 2015. Uh, this is Metal Gear Solid. This is the Shagglehod. This is, these are some rough sketches for Snake. So what are these? 
this looks like it might be four stuff. So yeah, four actually did get an art book in Japan. And um, I'll show you actually when some we're going through here. Just look at a bunch of this stuff. Oh, it's the boss. So yeah, and they also have little translations in here as to the stuff. This is pretty nuts. So a lot of these are pages from from the Metal Gear 4 book. In fact, I might want to, just for the hell of it, I might decide to check a lot of this stuff out in the actual book, the Japanese book, and see how close a lot of these are. Still, so this is... Huh. The sketches for Snake... This is oh, this right here seems to be a lot of Peace Walker stuff. I notice. Yep, yeah, that's like the, the the boards for Peace Walker. So interesting. The ground the ground works the, the the this one actually does not go up to five. It actually goes up to Peace Walker, which is interesting. Well, I'm gonna look a little further in here. Let's see. It might just be that they're comp combining Peace Walker and, um, nope, this is Peace Walker at the end here. So, this book does not actually go up to five. It actually goes up to Peace Walker, which is interesting. Let's put that aside. Which is a really cool thing. It actually has a really nice uh, spine-like shine to it, which is great. And then now we're going to just quickly check through the gallery works which is a lot of which i think is a lot of the key art i don't exactly know so yeah i'm guessing a lot of this stuff is all the the stuff from oh so i own the first um art of metal gear solid book it came out in 1999 or 1998 so a lot of these pages actually look very familiar to me this is actually the um this a lot of that looks like the setup from that oh, pages are sticking together so yeah a lot of these look like the page setups from those which is kind of cool it looks like a lot of this was reprints that's new these are different that's the same so yeah a lot of these actually are pretty much the, the looks like a lot of these are just reprints of the actual books that they produced so so this is metal gear solid three right that's also the that's the the game boy the dba one or uh 3ds so yeah here's some more stuff from three we call it gallery works but it's interesting it's so here's the guns of the patriots guns of the patriots also got a it did get a art book and this a lot of this looks like stuff from the art book the excuse me the original art book from japan so it just this is actually pretty awesome it's literally a combination of all the books that have come out in japan in fact this right here is the cover to the peace walker book i'll show that to you in a bit ah and then here again it always it all goes up to peace walker these books all end at Peace Walker. So, I wouldn't say this is false advertisement, but it's not one to five. It's actually one to Peace Walker. Interesting. But here's the, the good thing about it, all of this. Is that the fact that if you own the, the, um, the, gr the Ground Zero slash of Metal Gear Solid 5 version, you pretty much get every single art book. Now, I'm going to show you and give you an idea of how much work is actually in this book because uh, as i said a lot of this stuff seems to be things from the actual unreleased metal gear solid um books from japan so all right here we go i got a little one right here so as i said this thing does not it looks like it doesn't include up to five so these right here are is pretty much every single book that was released in japan so comparatively well, let's see if i could do, do one of these things comparatively you could say this let's put them all together so this is all these books together and then these are all these books so it's literally you're getting all these books inside of this one package which is up metal gear metal gear one through four and peace walker which is pretty damn awesome so yeah 
So I'll just show you a lot of these. This is the first Metal Gear Solid, Art of Metal Gear Solid book. This was in Japan. There's actually a revision version of this with a new cover and some additional artwork. It's kind of hard to see. Uh, this is actually a Metal Gear Solid 2. I'm sorry. I didn't even see that. Here is the Metal Gear Solid 1 version. So yeah, this one actually came out in Japan, and this one has an alternate version. This is the Metal Gear Solid 2 one. Uh, here is the Metal Gear Solid 4 one, which was pretty rare. You can find that very many places. And then here's the, the good old Peace Walker. So essentially you're getting all, all of these books inside of those inside of this package from one one to one to four plus metal gear solid three which didn't really get a um a release uh or a book from what i know so yeah let's uh open it up to any questions if you guys have any questions about what's going on or you know what things you might want to see stuff like that i'm here for you looks like uh not many people are actually here but hey what's up guys how's it going so yeah like this is pretty damn awesome i mean just to have this one like giant dictionary of pretty much every single thing from the metal gear series probably with the exception of metal gear solid um acid or uh, metal gear acid and metal gear um what do they call it the two metal acid games and the and a portable ops. I don't think portable ops is in here either. But we'll see. Because yeah, a lot of this is all... This is four, and then there's Peace Walker at the end. So yeah! It's not one through five. It's actually one through Peace Walker. I wouldn't say... I, would, I'm, I'm, I wouldn't say it was false advertising. But it's interesting that it happened that way. But anyway... Looks like there's not many people uh, actually doing this, but hey, yeah, guys, you know, this is actually, this is probably the best thing that you could probably get if you ever wanted to complete your Metal Gear-ish, you know, designs and, you know, like have a, a, but just one source of where all this stuff is. I can't, I can't even say how amazing this thing is, even though I already own these, pretty much most of the books that are found inside of this thing. A lot of this stuff is pretty damn comprehensive. There's just so much stuff in there as far as design, tech, all kinds of stuff. And it's pretty damn awesome. And I definitely suggest that you pick it up. And it's not a lot of money. It's about 70 bucks or more on Amazon. So yeah, go check it out. And uh, thank you for joining me for this little bit of an unbo this unboxing. I mean, you know definitely uh you know keep an eye on our channel which is uh throwdown and also make sure to follow us on throwdown show on twitter facebook as well as youtube we're also on periscope and we're also on twitch i don't know if twitch is working right now we're getting some sort of things but yeah good stuff i am emilio lopez and uh thank you for joining me